They coming, they coming, they coming. Hit the button, hit the button. Young world. So Deontay Wilder finally comes out of his shell and breaks his silence after the loss to Tyson Fury, which was like, but damn near a year, whatever ago it was. But a lot of months ago. I think it was about a year ago at this time. The Joker comes out and says out of his own mouth, he believes that something spooky happened to him in that ring. And I'm going to sit here and co-sign the Joker because I think something happened too. I seen Young Fowler broke down the whole thing about the gloves and everything. And it, I, I believe for damn sure that something was up with them Tyson Fury's gloves in both of the fights, one and two. But Deontay Wilder said that he actually believes that somebody poisoned his water. And God damn it, I'm not going to sit here and say he's crazy. I'm not going to just automatically say it's definitely true and believe it because you know, you know how I think. But I'm not going to sit here and discount the Joker either because plenty of reasons why they, the main, the thing is, they don't, they, they don't want a person like that with the warrior spirit coming out here and possibly influencing other people's warrior spirit to come out and the stuff he was on to make it and, you know what I'm saying? They will go to endless lengths to stop a Joker like that from coming out. Cause he's out here knocking people he's not a basketball player he's not a rapper you know what i'm saying he's not a he's out here actually putting in real work with the warrior spirit and showing him giving people hope you know what i'm saying that gives you a different type of strength and hope you know what i'm saying like it gives you a different type of outlook it's stronger the, the influence is stronger for somebody like that and he was on that pro black stuff that's why i believe that it's possible that they would have went to the length and you sitting there like oh his, his own person wasn't doing it i think he kind of hinted to or he made it just came out and said that it might have been somebody on his own team you like oh how was somebody because that's how they get people they get they come to you somebody on your team who you're with who's close to you and that's how they are able to infiltrate you you never know what they, they be having dirt on jokers blackmail People like, oh, he's making money with Deontay. How you know somebody might come and offer way more money than he's making with Deontay Wilder or something like that? Or, like I said, they might have some information on you that you don't want to get out. It could be a blackmail type of situation. They know something about illegal something that you did. So, you know what I'm saying? All types of things could have happened for somebody to turn on somebody like you believe, believe it's not possible. It's possible. It's definitely always, especially when you're in the realms of those type of people celebrities, money, Hollywood, the industry. Like, that's where the big money is at. That's where the people that can make stuff. You, you think you in your in your hood, you got a, people running around hustling that can throw a couple of dollars at a joker and make him go do something to somebody for a couple hundred dollars if he's desperate. Especially if you got money, you give a joker that. Imagine if you got access to millions, resources, all type of stuff, houses, cars, homes, women. Like you can, they can, they can make anybody. And then, like I said, they got the law on their side. Then they got the they could the blackmail type they, the information. They got all. All type of stuff that can make somebody turn on somebody who's not really w with somebody. You know, the Deontay Wilder could, could have made his own people matter. So it might be around him and can't. There's a lot of people with money. We got people around him that hate their guts. You know what I'm saying? Jokers can't stand, can't wait till something happens to them so they can rob them or get. That, that's just how this works. So, long story short, I'm not gonna sit there and say I it's automatically got to be a conspiracy or something, but. I damn sure won't doubt if it was because them gloves, them gloves, goddamn for sure look shady for damn sure. I seen them young fella broke that all the way down in the water. I won't doubt it one bit. No matter where it came from, no matter who you said has to see who do what before the fight and how it works, I believe it's a possibility that they got him out because they don't want people like that coming to the like influence people blowing up with his strength, saying the stuff he was saying. He was getting on his black power stuff real strong, the kinds of stuff. They don't want that. They'll do anything to get rid of that. Understand that. So that's why, yeah, it's possible.